So... That's it? That's all that was up here? Consider this giant... Creepy... Possibly precursor structure? I'd call it more metalhead, but I don't know. Oh god, of course. <laughs> Wanna be Jack and Daxter without me failing to jump down a simple puzzle area? Or simple platform area? Oh no, that was... I try to jump. I try to do a long jump. Like this. That's it. That's all I wanted. <sighs> Dark? Okay, it, it's not telling me anything new. I figured that, uh... I'd get something out of it, you know? He said it was new power, so I assumed that it would mean I would get that power permanently, because I touched the artifact. But maybe it's not like that. Maybe it's a thing where you can only use invisibility when you're touching the artifact. And only if you've touched Dark- or if you've been in contact with Dark Eco successfully before. A.K.A. Jack. Maybe Parsley Daxter. But we don't really know about that. Oh. Hey, the other one's open now. Or it's glowing at least. Can I successfully touch it and be totally fine? <gasps> I understand. This will let me get past that thing. Interesting. So it makes me invisible. For a short duration. Got you. It could be a weapon of some type. You never know. Uh -huh. Now we can advance further into the temple. Perfect. The invisible thing, or the eye thing, will not stab me every time I try to come over here. Not that I knew that it would do that. Uh oh. Spiders! I like how they were looking at me even though I was kind of invisible. <laughs> right? Like, if they had legitimately seen me, they would have been firing. Or they would have been firing. What are they, fucking mecha spiders? Anyways, they would have been trying to attack me as I was standing in front of them. But they didn't. So that's fine. Because we're going to go ahead and do some blast. Oh, I landed on top of one as it was attacking. That was unfortunate. I think I probably would have been better off just slamming down like this. But this looks intimidating. We've got a dark eco vent. Let's see what it does. I see. Let us power ourselves permanently. I will imbue myself with everlasting darkness. How do I do the dark bomb? Oh, I jump and then do it. Oh. Okay. I got it wrong. I thought it was, you just press both the buttons together. No, it's jump and then dark bomb. I understand. Let's continue on. Even if I can't become giant mode anymore. That was kind of cool, even though I barely used it. Oh boy. What are you guys doing in here? No! Stop it! Ow! I just die immediately. Let's see if they like the power of Dog Jack. Uh, 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 we're gonna... I'm glad I'm not your stunt double. Right? I just die all the time. Okay. So let's try something else, like grabbing the invisib invisibility thing on the other side, and then maybe possibly destroying everything. Or just standing on the platform, I don't know. I did it! And now everything's gonna look at me, aren't they? I don't know, but I'm gonna destroy everything I can! There you go! Perfect. Now I don't have to worry about dying, either way. I wonder how badly it would suck to be the person who came in here without, uh, filling up on dark powers. Uh-oh. Uh-uh-uh! That is not what we do around here, spiders! We are polite to all the people in this world. Even if they've died multiple times and you're like, what the fuck, how'd this guy get behind us? 
Alright, I guess I'll go this way. Look at that. Yin Yang symbol. It's so obvious, it's painful to look at. But I understand. Light versus dark. The perfect balance between one soul and killing shitloads of spiders. Killing way too many fucking spiders. Are you fucking done? Thank you. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, that's rude. God. So, let me guess. I have to... Navigate through here. With invisibility, because otherwise I get electrocuted. Got you. That means they want me to be fast. Just straight up get to the other side and survive. Mm-hmm. If only I could shoot the eyeballs. Then I could truly be accepted as someone deserving to go through these places. Woo. No, I wonder if the Naughty Dogs developers knew about their whole, uh, spinning extension thing. I mean, you can't make three games without knowing about something as simple as that, right? Well, you have to remember, this was a time where DSL was just kind of starting to come around. And who the hell would look online with dial-up to see what people think of their game? Not many! Not many people! You're just like, you release it, and you see what kind of game reviews you got. And I, I doubt game reviewers would be like, Oh man, well, the best thing that I learned in the game was that you can jump and press O to extend your jump. And then that just stays in there for three games. But I also- Oh God! Jesus Christ! Alright. I will embrace my darkness once more to destroy something even far more sinister than dark. Ow! Fucking spider. Here we go. Dark bomb! Perfect. Of course, there's still more. Well, you know what? I have reflecting bullets. <laughs> oh, shit! That was awesome! Oh my god! I need to do that more often. Just spin inside of a super tight hallway and just murder everything! I am content with this. Now what is this supposed to be? Okay. It's a yin-yang symbol, so I was like, maybe it activates when I show my darkness inside. But I guess not. Although, by the looks of things, maybe when I go back out, I'll have yin-yang powers. I'm putting a lot on that. Oh, shit. I want no excuses. You told me this could be done. Now make it so. But we have so little time. The day star approaches. You know what it brings. Unfortunate, yes. We will deal with that as soon as I have full access to the catacombs. Just continue your work, and I'll deal with those idiots in Haven. I promise, you will meet your makers. Why are the catacombs so important? I don't know. Maybe the giant fucking precursor statue right in front of you? That seems like it'd be pretty evident. But alright, let's do some puzzle platforming. Hey! It's one of those goober-eyed precursor thingies. Greetings, ah. great warrior. Your return brings us great hope. This planet's future is at a critical juncture. The Dark Ones have found your world again, and fate hangs in the balance where the past and the future collide. Do you have any idea what he just said? Speak at the normal language, okay? You will need all the power you can muster to survive this terrible test, Great One. I can handle it. I was talking to the Tall One, Shorty. Ooh! He went there! Look into the light and receive a power hero. This doesn't sound very safe. Oh, all right. Okay. Well, then now you're scaring me. Dax, the dark eco. It feels far away. I feel better. Great! 
Light Jack Regeneration. Hold L2, then press triangle. Whoa! Whoa! I have... Light power! I have no idea what that means! But neat! So when I'm hurt, I can regenerate myself with light powers. And so the light powers aren't gonna be like an offensive tool until maybe later, but maybe they'll never become it. Maybe they'll just be supporting tools like, oh shit, I lost all my health. Let, let me use a little bit of my light powers to support myself. Whoosh. Get ya. Like it. Where the hell am I now? Oh, back in here. Should I go? Oh. Nope. I am not allowed to enter the catacombs. Can I go back to the front door? No. I guess we'll have to see what happens. We know about seams. So let's take our departure out of here. That's that person's name, right? Seam? Seams? I'm worried about them. They might be a villain. Terrible villain. But I can also believe that they're trying to do something, right? Alright, extra drive. <laughs> L1 to do massive super jump! Oh boy! Too big of a super jump! Jesus Christ! Help! I flipped and I can't get up! Oh no! Can I press triangle to flip things over? Oh, I just get back in. Yeah, that's helpful! That's helpful, Jack. Oh! I just want to flip it back! Punch! Punch! Flip! Go! Shazam! Kabam! I've hurt my vehicle trying to get it back up. You're kidding me. Alright! Let's try blowing it up then. Okay, it's starting to be on fire. How much health does it have left? Not a terrible amount. I'm trying to kill it so that way I can just get it back up somewhere else, you know, like a respawn. Vehicle destroy- That fails my mission?! Well then maybe it shouldn't have flipped over without any ways to flip it back over, huh? Fucking game. Try to blame this shit on me. What? Oh. Okay! Whatever! It just teleported me straight back to the to the city, <laughs> which saves me the entire trouble of having to come back here, which is great. Hi there. Move quickly to this spot and show me why we should trust the fate of this world to you. Okay, I guess I can do that. The green one, that green thing is probably. I have no idea where that green thing is. I guess I should've- I just figured it'd be on my map! I j- I feel gypped. Not good. We are concerned you lack the burning desire a hero must have. Okay, I have desire, alright? I just need to have better information then. Oh, by the way! It's chilling out in this one place overlooking this other place. Fuck it, I'll just jump around and hope for the best. Okay, you know what, hold on, I, I need to look at the environment real quick. Because I have no idea what that is. I really don't. Everything looks the same in this place. And I'm sure once I get the idea of where the hell this thing is, Everything will be great. I can't imagine it's super far away. Oh, there it is! Just right around the corner. Okay. Got it! Very good. You give us hope for the future. Fantastic, I'm glad. You can now afford to purchase new secrets. Well, since you said so, so nicely, I guess I could buy a blaster damage upgrade. Boom! Boom! I can't even turn it off if I want to. <gasps> oh, why? <sighs> I 
Oh well. There's a lot of things I will not buy at all. So I'm totally okay with using it all on weapon upgrades and vehicle upgrades. I don't care about secret galleries. I don't care about... Cheats? None of that. If I wanted to cheat, I'd get a game shark. Or if I was on PC, I'd just get a trainer. And then I'd sneer at some of the sites that make you pay for a trainer and go, you fucking assholes. Because they'd always be the ones with the horns that work. But that's not me. I don't use trainers anymore. Honestly. So are we doing another challenge? Because now I'm powered up with Light Eco. And I can imagine... That will make this next challenge pretty easy. Hi. You just having fun chilling in your chair? Attention all people of Spargus. A large storm is heading our way. Prepare the city. Oh. Jack, there are four wastelanders out there who still have not reported in. I want you to go out and find them. Do whatever it takes to bring them back. I thought it was survival of the fittest. I mean, I know you care about your city, but if they're outside, you know, surely they know how to take cover in a cave. Those exist. I'm pretty sure those exist outside. I'd hope they'd exist outside. But oh well. Come on, Leaper. We've got to go save people. There we go. I was about to say, can I not use it? Have I been bamboozled out of my own Leaper? Those bastards! At least I have Dark Eco, which is apparently just contained in rats. Oh boy. I'm sorry about killing your girls, but I just needed to do it! They were in the way! And by being in the way, they're preventing a hero from saving the world! You know, I had to say the same about these two gals! Boom! All these gals in the way. You too. Do you want- I will do- Just show my theory upon all of you- Whoa, hello! What was that? That was either Light Eco or Blue Eco. I'm just gonna say it's Light Eco, the way it looks. Alright. Let's go for a ride. Right? There's no mission cutscene. So I'm assuming I just go out in the car? And then it'll activate? There we go. All right. We've got a minute and 30 seconds to pick up this one person. I would say that would be the entire time to the storm, but it probably isn't that way, honestly. We're going to get them and the, the time's going to extend. Unless these guys are so unfortunate that they legitimately only had a minute until they were dying to the sandstorm. Oh, jeez. My handling's going all over the place. And I don't want to blame it on a storm, but, uh, seems mighty coincidental. Okay, alright, I'm just trying to drive straight here, you know. Fucking wind and sand. Movie tires aren't the best thing on these, uh, areas out here. Sup? I ran him over. Oops. Over here. Get in my car! Hey, you're a life Thank you! No oh, shit. The time didn't go up. The time did not go up at all. Even though it took him a long time to hop in my ride. Oh shit. That means I need to hurry. Jack, brother, come on. 30 seconds to pick up the other two, man. Shenanigans. Oh, ball see you, Rock. Hop on in. You're the best, buddy. Oh, okay. They had to make it back to their machines. That's all. Got you. I thought it was 30 seconds to pick up another guy and then pick up two more people. No, we're good. I'm totally fine. I was right. Just didn't expect the a slightly extended bit of that. Hey, look, we got a moon. I mean, most places, well, I wouldn't say most places have moons. Our planet has a moon, so that's nice of it. All right, let's turn back around. If someone can be in my way, so that way I can get stuff off of them, that would be great. Look at this guy. What a trooper! 
What an amazing... That would be the word. Philanthropist, yes! Giving me all of these boosts so that way I can help out this poor citizen. And maybe I shouldn't be in the water. This is the worst possible place I could be because it slows me down. Yo! If you wanted me to worry about the storm, your ass shouldn't have been out here in the first place. Ah, oh, jeez. Want the core? Want the little core? Okay, grand, awesome. I've got three boosts, and that's what matters. Yeah, quite a bit. Not the most, but I I'm happy about it. Oh, jeez. No! <laughs> Shit. I was gonna go over the uh, the bridge, gap, and everything. Damn it. You know, I wonder. I wonder what the other cars will be like. Will there ever be one where I actually legitimately aim the gun, or will all of them be based on the orientation of my car? I don't know. But I'm kinda dying here. I'm worried about this. Whoa, boy! No! Not speed it up backwards driving! Oh, there we go, we flipped. That's what matters. All right. Ah, is this the third guy or the fourth guy? I don't even remember. I'm just picking people up. <laughs> that guy's just flipping over. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on! We can make it! We're so close! I'll put a good word in with Davis. All right, that was number three. And apparently we have... Four minutes to save the last guy, which means he's probably really far out there. Look at this asshole. Everyone else is like really up here, and then we got this guy. Oh shit. I knew I shouldn't have listened to Jim. Jim said there'd be some great artifacts down here in the south. Now I'm about to die. Only artifacts that's gonna be left is my bones. Fucking Jim. And I agree. Fucking Jim. Jesus. I cannot see worth of anything in this storm. I mean, I don't know about the whole skin flaying part, but it would definitely suck having all this sand blocking your way. Oh gosh. I'm coming, Timmy! 